Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough and this time we're going to be journeying into the Pear Kingdom also known as Thunder Thighs Kingdom. So let's just clap our hands and go to the deep sea sprint. This is obviously going to be a race and we are going to be racing turtles. Go 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 go. And it looks like they're all taking different paths and this looks like the best path to take because you've got that boost like current area whatever you want to call it and woo Look at me go! As you can see, you want to try and stay in the currents as much as possible and avoid the jellyfish of death while trying to cut through the corners. Well, like, I did not cut through that corner very well and I'm losing my place! Now it also means I'm going to lose the amount of points that I have, but that's okay. <laughs> ah! Wait, 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 don't I? Isn't there a different way? Yeah, go this way. Oh, yeah, you want to go that way for more points in general through the whole level. It'll cost you a little bit of time, but you'll uh, still get a good amount of points if you clap your hands properly through that area, which I kind of forgot to do as I was journeying through it. Oh, whoops. <laughs> and we're going down. Oh, man, I'm really behind the third place. Obviously, that wasn't the best race I've ever done in my life, but eh. What are you gonna do? Well, let's jump out of the water, grab the pear, take a bite out of it, and bonus grabbing bananas! My god, he can eat bananas quickly. Yeah, I think I would've got 200 points if I would've won the race, or something like that. Oh, I forgot to mention to you guys, um, I found out the uh, way from one of my um, watchers on my channel, uh, what the platinum and gold values are for each level, but platinum is around 12, I, I mean 1,200, I was going to say 1,200, but really that's not very, uh, um, a real word, so to speak, <laughs> so to speak in the n numerical language or whatever you want to call it. Uh, oh, this is going to be poopy, isn't it? Because I have the dodge cannonballs on this dang bird. Alright, we can do this. Dodge the balls. <laughs> wait, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, man. I have to do it all over again. Ah, this time I'm going to get through it. I just, I just swooped myself just a little bit too high and I couldn't redirect myself to go to the right because as I said before, when you flap your wings, you get just a little bit of lift with your flaps. And obviously I couldn't get myself into that hole there. Oh well, and wait. Oh, that's a. Those are wall treadmills, by the way. You can use them to increase the height of your uh, wall jumps. Obviously. <laughs> uh, wait a second. This one's gonna fire. Oh man, I lost that. I'm just getting hit all over the place, and I just fell right into that lightning. This is like the worst obstacle course ever in the history of obstacle courses. Oh, oh. Oh, <laughs> I'm not liking this at all. Fall down DK. Okay, I think I got it this time. Do not touch the lightning. Yay, and clap here. Keep your combo as long as you can. Climb up the monkeys. Oh, yeah, they climb up for you to keep your combo going with good monkeys. They definitely do not have thunder thighs because they are able to climb fairly well. Actually, quite well. Um, wow, this is tight. Oh, no, not you! <laughs> well, at least that wasn't that bad this time. Yay! Punch the bee's belly! Clap, clap, clap. Woo! And that's the end of the... Oh, oh, I guess I could combo a little bit more there. I tried, I tried to do exactly that, and I, I didn't think I could grab onto it, actually. And those are ninja monkeys, by the way. They're going to cause some trouble for you. Oh, wait, no, they're... they're oh, wait, what, what am I saying? Why am I saying ninja monkeys? Those aren't the ninja monkeys. <laughs> uh, I, was, I was thinking too much of that other level where I got owned every single way possible. Can I get up? Yes, I can. Clap on the bird. Keep your combo as much as you possibly can. Uh, is this clock hands? This is clock hands, isn't it? Those are going to spin. Oh, yep, yep, here they come. Okay, now I gotta try and redirect myself around the clock hands without losing my combo, if that's possible. I'm sure it's possible, the game wouldn't design itself to be mean, would it? Especially with those nice little birdies over there. 
even if I lost my bird, I could just flap myself right back up there. And try to stay out of the cannon's range. That was very nice if you could do that. Yeah, there we go. I'm pretty sure I can get through here. Can I get through here? No, I can't. But I think I'm going to keep my combo. I'm just going to land. So I can, yeah, get my combo so I don't lose my combo later. Uh, oh, no! Why must I fall? Why must gravity play a factor in side-scrollers? Oh, there's the exit. You're supposed to go out the 12 o'clock position. Oh wait, there's the fruits! Give me fruits! Yummy! And... Eat some more fruit, DK! Go, chow down! Man, with all the banana seeds, he certainly never gets chunky. He's all muscle. No thunder thighs on DK. And I have a terrible score. I was not able to keep any combos whatsoever. Well, I kept a couple combos. Oops. This is Gloat Hog, the last of the Hog family. Obviously the hardest one, but still, you know, the strategy for beating the Hogs. Clap their fruit right back at them. Not the spiky ones, though. Yeah, and he's going to drop over here. That's not good. Uh, I'm going to stand right on the edge. Yeah. And can I clap. Yes. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I, I just seen that fruit bounce back out. I don't remember that doing that before. I wonder if that's something that I'll have to avoid. Unless I'm just overthinking things, like I always do. And it, he's just gonna... Uh, can I get it up there? I don't think so. Nope, I didn't think so. Oh, no, 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 no. Whoa, lightning attack! And I just got right out of the way perfectly. So, whatever. It did not matter whatsoever. Go up! Oh, he's gonna go up there. So that means my coconut is completely useless. Ah! Why must I take hits? Ah, it's a side-scroller again. So, you know, taking hits is part of the game. Unless you're like some sort of DK jungle bee god or something. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Oh, what the heck? I hit the wrong bongo. Why did I do that? And he's gonna go to... Oh, it's gonna be hard to dodge at that angle. Okay. What? Wait, 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 wait. Clap. Yes, I got on that time. I perfectly timed that for once. Yay me! And now he's gonna get really ticked off here. He smokes cup. Whoa, my god! I don't remember him doing that before. Probably because I haven't played the game in a while. Come on, throw a ball. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah, baby! Oh, man! Yeah, you do have to worry about them reflecting off of, off of him on back half towards you. And buddy, anyway, he is dead. And another hog gets turned to bacon by my hands. Yay! Obviously, I lost some beats there from a couple hits. Let's check out my score. And... I don't think that's even enough for silver. I think silver is a 500. And let's check out the movie. This camera hates me. Well, the memory card does. I kind of lost the video footage for the uh, hint video thing that I always show at the end. Well, I kind of showed a little bit of it. The bird went in some center of some clock and got a whole load of uh, bananas, basically. Speaking of bananas, I still don't understand how Donkey Kong can eat all those bananas at once and not get thunder thighs. I don't know. Maybe those bananas are good for digestion with their vitamin BS. Well, I guess that's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you all later in the next...